Hey guys, so today we're going to be doing a transformative haul. So the first doll I got today was Dolly from Winter Chill, Winter Disco, Winter Disco. Her hair is tragic. And she's missing a hand, but I want to see if I can match one to her. And it looks like someone like stabbed something through it. Yeah, that's her. We got a Barbie. Not sure what Barbie. Doesn't really matter to me though. Barbies are Barbies. Disney Belle doll. She came with stuff. She has her hair chopped off. This thing who came with a doll. It says Hasbro on the body. Do not know what this is. Nikki. I believe that's who it is at least. Barbie, I believe this is the one with the stroller, but I could be wrong. Cali Girl Barbie. Not sure if that's actually who it is, but it's from the Cali Girl line. Freshwater Laguna with a major haircut, but she has both of her arms, so. She's good for in case I get a broken one or I can find her head super cheap or something. But yeah. And last but not least, we have Viperine from the Gulebrities in Lundum. She's missing an arm, but like this is still attached to her head. And this is still fastened. So we love an abused queen. But yeah, let's get started. So we're gonna start with making space. I'm gonna start with Dwali. Some water going. I need to get soup. So all that one's gonna get. Barbie in here. This Barbie too. And this Barbie. Oh. And Belle. And hey, we're gonna set her aside for now. And we're gonna kinda let that fill up. And we're gonna take Dolly and run some water over her. We ran some water over Dolly. Some dish soap.
Krishner in uh, what's her face's head. Hey guys, so I'm gonna show you the afters, starting with the ones who don't really matter, aka this Laguna. She can see lots of chopped hair. So it doesn't really matter, she needs a new head anyway, but I bought her mainly for her body and arms. It's obviously hard to come by in a decent condition. Belle, she just came with something. Don't really care about her. I might eventually remove the glue and try and even out the haircut and do something with her, but I don't know. For now, she's literally just a beating toy. This thing, if you ever want to let me know what the fuck it is, I got no clue. It's scary looking to me. Body says Hasbro. Terrifying. 
Now onto the ones that do matter. Here is Dolly. See, she has more of her bangs back now. Her hair is up in a ponytail because it is pretty bad. I tried to cut some of it out so that it would balance out between the frizzy hair and the nice hair. But it is still pretty like burnt feeling in places. But here she is. She looks a lot better. And she's wearing a extra B-girl top, icy girl's underwear, and extra B-girl shoes. Oh, and she borrowed a class press hand. Because I have this extra here. Here we have Cali Girl Barbie. She was already looking nice, so. Here is the puppy Barbie, I think. I don't know, I haven't really finalized, like, I haven't identified them. But I just put them in outfits that I thought would fit them. The very glam, whorish looking Barbie. This top and this jacket go to the same fashion pack, and I actually own the skirt to it too. But, um, it's on a rainbow high doll at the moment. These are Bratz pants, by the way. They belong to the, uh, 2012, I think. The taller Bratz Chloe pants for wildlife. And then here we have the Nikki looking doll. Last but not least, one of my favorites is this Viperine. Just borrowing my basic Viperine to arm. I do still have her glasses, but the arm broke and I tried to glue them. But I don't want to get glue in her hair, so... I'll wait till I know they're dry and then I'll put them on with the elastic. Here's my original Viperine. So she still obviously needs shoes... And an arm, but yeah. Happy to own her. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this haul slash transformation video. And yeah, I'll see you all later. Bye!